All right. Sweet. Okay, let me pull up the chat as usual. Interesting. Sorry, my chat's being weird. Interesting, why is it not playing? There we go. Much better. All right. Hey, everyone. Um, I'm going to wait for a few people to get up here. And then we're going to get started with some puzzles. I also finally got the audio to work on this, so it might actually work now. Um, it'll be a little delayed, but I think that's okay. We'll be fine. Why is my mouth open? Why is my mouth open? Hold on. Ah! My mouth is like stuck open. Oh my god. My mouth is like stuck open. That's kind of uncomfortable. Uh, that is interesting. That's really weird. Oh well. This is weird. Oh, frick. Ah. This is really weird. Why is my mouth stuck open? I'm in just that much sock, huh? Why? My mouth is open. <laughs> this is uncomfortable. Oh, by the way, let me know if the audio is, like, good or not. Okay. Cheryl arrives at the conclusion that Rex must have slipped out into the garden. Cat agrees that he hasn't gone bananas, and the team of detectives heads outside. However, the pet is nowhere to be seen in the garden, either. Now convinced that Rex must have left the grounds, the team resigns themselves to widening their search area. There we go. There's a mouth closed. Wait, hold up. Close! Ah. Mm. Ah. Look, I'm trying some embarrassing facial positions to try to get my mouth to close, okay? Mm. Herschel. <gasps> Snake, don't do this to me. Mm. Don't do that to me. I'm I'm I miss Herschel too. <laughs> All right, time to ask people in the vicinity. I <laughs> snake. You know I don't know that. <laughs> Why is my mouth still open? Oh my god. Okay. I know it's not late without Herschel, but guess what? It's still a good effing game. <laughs> look, look at the puzzle. Yeah, look at the puzzle. Oh my god, a closed mouth. Beautiful. Finally. 
you need to use this truck to get through the other side of the tunnel, but the truck is just a little bit too tall and it won't fit. It looks like if it would get, if a little something was removed from it, but what? You're not allowed to break the truck or move, or take off anything that isn't normally removable. I mean, technically a tire, but I don't think that's their point. If a little something. I mean, you could also just remove the tunnel. But you have to remove it from the truck, right? I mean, the wheels is like... Should I try? Yeah, the chapter system, I... I don't know, I find it good for organizational purposes, but other than that, you know, kind of odd. But whatever, I'm going to try wheel. Would it be wheels or tires? It's a truck, right? It's just tires. Oh, yeah, kind of the free roaming. You're right. It's probably going to be wrong. Yeah, it's wrong. I mean, honestly, if I could get rid of the tunnel, that would be wonderful. That would, like, solve this whole problem. Oh. Without stopping the truck from moving. As long as too much of it is... As long as not too much of it is removed. So they knew what I was doing. <laughs> oh man, not the pick reds. Fine, give me a hint. Ugh, I can't alter the tunnel. Oh, Miracle Mask was so good. Mm. I have to say I'm a little biased with Phoenix Wright and Professor Layton, but in terms of like solo Professor Layton games, honestly, Diabolical Box, but I think that's just because I like Anton. Oh yeah, Unmon Future too. I really liked Unmon Future. I know, I'm trying to remove the tires. Do they want you to remove, like, the front tires or something? Like, you can still move a truck. Yeah, Diabolical Box was definitely kind of, like, earlier. Ah, uh, fine. Bro, I can't believe it. I'm... Just getting three hints on stream. I did focus on the bottom of the truck. I said the tires. You know what? Maybe I should just put wheels. Oh. Wheel as in a singular wheel. That might work too. I have a feeling that perhaps I got it wrong. <gasps> this is so sad. No. <laughs> like, what else is at the bottom of the truck? Like, there's the axle, but, like, that's not going to be helpful. Because you, you especially can't move the truck then. I mean, you could just remove the front of it. Oh yeah, Curious Village. I, I mean, I've played all of them and I like all of them, but yeah. Curious Village was actually pretty decent for a first game, to be honest. For that time period. A lot of them were kind of like that. At, kind of around that time. A lot of, like, mystery games. Puzzle games. <sighs> Fine, I'll take a fourth hint. That's really how they spell- They spell tires with a Y? Actually, yeah, that's smart. It's probably air. They spell tires with a Y. That's not even like... Oh, nice job. Thanks, Snake. <laughs> oh, wait, no, that was Shido, not Snake. Hi, Shido. Thanks for the- <laughs> Thanks for making me realize it. 
go. I was just out like remove the wheels. <laughs> oh, that smashing that is. T tires with a Y is not the British way to spell tires, is it? The one with the fish logo. Honestly, yeah, just go around the wall. Like, you don't have to pull a spirited away. My mouth is stuck open again. Animes, please. Animes, please. Oh well. That one comes straight from the worth, I believe. The wolf. Yeah, I do kind of miss the open exploration, not gonna lie. I agree with you there, Snake. Wait, I thought I was supposed to ask around. I only asked one person. Oh, Riddleton! Okay, who's this? Maybe I already asked her and I didn't realize it. Nah. Hey, bro. She needed time to think. She's a kid. Alright, let's see. Do we have any hit coins that I haven't grabbed yet? Come on, there was, I heard a I heard a puff. Okay, maybe not. I thought I heard a puff. Oh, there it is. Uh. Yeah, let's keep going. At least they make the traveling convenient. You have arrived at wharf. Mm. The van. Yeah. Okay, I gotta admit, this part of the game, I do like. Like, this part where it's, like, connecting the gold pieces or whatever. Like, I understand the mechanics, and I like the mechanics, but I don't get it. Like, you know, like, why it exists. There's like a lot of, yeah, with, yeah, suffering trying to make things 3D, I don't know, in this game I feel like it's more evidence that like they've tried way too hard to add like a ton of random mini games and gimmicks. Like personally, I think it's kind of a lot. <laughs> um, so. Anyway, I do like that you can actually like change her outfit. I love it. Good. I can also make it look like Anton. But to be honest, this looks better on her. And yeah, I'm not really gonna talk about Pokemon because that is, mm, that's some controversial takes in the gamer community. Yeah, but to be honest, it's like, I guess I just don't expect that much from Pokemon, you know? Poponyo. Cute! Okay, no problemo. Maybe you'd like this cute bunny puzzle instead. Bunny puzzle. Happy bunnies. Oh god. <laughs> Some rabbits are playing in the field. The rule is that they have to go between the two other rabbits whenever they move. And it looks like they all want to end up in the patch of flowers. Oh god. You mean here? Yeah, Scarlet and Violet, I'm, I mean, I'm definitely still gonna play it because I'm just like, I'm like that, but like, yeah, I don't know how quality it'll be. I just know that the community's gonna like, no, not an impasse. Ah! I mean, I really like Legends Arceus. Honestly. Uh, bro, these instructions. I'm low-key, like, doing... Nope, that's a bad idea. Wait, F. 
Okay. Uh, here. Oh, wait. Crap, I can't put them next to each other. The newest... Okay. Here's the thing. I was going to stream it and everything, but I missed my alarm. And I missed the Scarlet and Violet trailer. So, yeah. Um, wait, no, I can't do that. I keep forgetting. Okay. It's seeming like one of the obvious first steps is to put it here. But then... I gotta find a way to move that one. I guess I can just keep going in a circle? Um, oh man, wait, that would be actually really close. No. Here we go. Oh wait, but then it can't. Hmm. Maybe this one. Oh, that didn't turn out how I wanted it to. I actually haven't seen the whole thing yet, I gotta admit. I didn't see the whole trailer yet. I got... I, like... I got busy and then I forgot. <laughs> I had a lot to do that day. <laughs> um, but I... learned about LeChonk. That, like, I heard about the new Pokemon releases and stuff. Um, but I didn't see the trailer itself, so I can't comment on, like, the gameplay or anything like that. That's not work any better. Mm. Okay, I have to move this one. Oh wait, that was a bad idea. Um. Yes, I do know about Lechunk. I swear, there there had to have been someone in the t in the pr production team that just knew that that was gonna be great for marketing. Wait, F. Okay. That was probably a bad idea, then. Let's get you... here. Wait, that's where you were originally. No. Oh, I guess I don't really have another choice. Oof. I kinda hate this. Is this just one of those ones where I'm just supposed to, like, F around until I figure it out? Oh no, I'm going in circles now. I can feel it. Only for LeChonk. You're gonna play the game only for LeChonk. Bruh. That's some... I don't know whether to say that's some dedication or like... Actually, I don't. Oh, also, I forgot to put it in the, my little text thing on the top, but like, my Steam Deck is coming. I like, just got the news today. Hold on, let's update that text, why don't we? The Steam Deck is... I can spell. Coming. I can spell. What if LeChonk evolves into, like, LeChungus? That would be, like, the most reasonable evolution. LeChungus. And then look like cat in a hat or something. I don't know. Ah! Wait, hold up. Yes, wait, hold up. Yeah, wait, no, no, go. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. Yes! Wait. Shit. Uh. Lithic. Oh my god, wait, yeah, you're right, Lithic. That would actually be really... If they actually pulled that off, I would cry. You know what, we're gonna get a hint, I'm sorry. I'm literally just, like, doing random moves. 
I figured that much. Ugh. Oh wait, that was a bad idea. Those are all bad ideas. Ooh. Yeah, no, what's with these hints, bro? Oh, come on. Oh, wait, no. F, okay. Wait, no. Hold up. No. I mean, I still gotta go that way. Oh, right. I wish I want this to work so bad, but it's not going to. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. No. Wait, don't. Look, it's a good thing they give me a lot of hint coins. Oh my god, you're kidding. Wait, really? Hmm. I don't like this. Nope. Um. Ooh, but then I won't be able to. Ah. Uh. Hmm. Oh, you're kidding. Okay, run doing that. Whatever. <laughs> okay. Um. You want? Know Give me that step by step guide, okay? Again, I figured that much. I feel like that's exactly what I've been doing. Alright, super hint. First move the top right rabbit to the edge, then move the two rabbits alternately. Top right? No, not quite. Okay, so it was what I was doing, but suddenly now that, like... Okay. Yeah, no, like, what is that? That's not a hint. <laughs> Oh, 
Yes, 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 yes! Finally! Ha ha! Let's go! We did it. Oh, shucks, I gotta drink water. Alright, it's water time after all that groaning. <laughs> I thought I had water. I thought I had more water than this. <laughs> there we go. There we go. I, I had water. <sighs> well, I didn't quite complete it in five steps, but whatever. I love how, like, that wasn't even a plot relevant puzzle. That was, like, an optional puzzle. <laughs> what a grand waste of time. Bro, you don't have to remind me. <laughs> Ah, oh, yes. Rawr. I'm gonna search for Rex at the wharf. Actually, I'm gonna search for those hint coins real fast. Cool. Anyway. Poof, what a pong. Boy! What kind of expression is that? It's dark and dingy, cramped and fishy. I gotta admit, I do, like, as much as it's a little overdone, I do kind of like how they play off the whole, like, she's more interested in food than guys, because, like, I kind of relate to that. Because that's, that's me. That's some ace representation right there. Bananas. Oh, well, miss, if you will, I will. In fact, the Sherlock Holmes Detective Consultancy... That sounds almost believable. Almost sounds believable. How did those words just switch in my brain? Barker Street, bro. Not the pun. Oh, Jesus. No, 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 no. Of course, they don't do voice acting, but they'll do the barking. Bro. Wait, I have to investigate. I'm gonna go investigate. Proceed, proceed to the footpath by the river. I didn't even investigate the boat, though. Oh, wait, I did. Oh, hold on, puffies. I got the strongman statue. Is that just an Oscar? Anyway. Ah, we've met before, I think, haven't we? Yes, we have met. <laughs> nah, it seems like he's kind of got a little bit of nitrous going. Catriel, don't ask questions you don't want the answers to. That's all I'm gonna say. <gasps> Bro, me too! <laughs> Obsessing over food and then being like, wait, did I eat? You know? Got the nine. Damn it. Why is my mouth stuck open? Spot to fishing. Hey, let's go. <laughs> That's actually really funny. Vagrants? Bruh, that's like calling them vermin. Oh. Why doesn't the can have a hint coin? That would be really good. 
like that. It's like a crime. All right, let's talk to the dog. A fatty of a puss that's white all over. <laughs> <laughs> but if you're looking for a fatty of a puss that's white all over, well then maybe I can help you out. <laughs> oh my god, I swear to god. I'm gonna clip that or something. What the hell? Uh... Yes, that's exactly the cat we're looking for. Wait, what? Bitch, what'd you do? Okay. Ugh. Ah, that's rough. Bro, I was in a play in third grade where that pun was like most of the play. I have not played Pokemon Reborn. I think I've only heard about it, honestly. I don't think I've actually, like, played it. Why is my mouth stuck open? Oh, well. No, I haven't played Reborn. I'll have to check it out. He saw a fat white pussy. <laughs> Wait, no, stop me! <laughs> Sorry, y'all. <laughs> Alright, y'all, we found the cat... We found the cat set. The joke has fallen right into my lap. And I don't want to say it on, on stream. <sighs> the joke that they just gave me the head for that specific part. Aww. Oh. I know they're irrelevant, but, like, I also kind of want to. This guy probably has a mystery puzzle. Oh my god, I was right. Do it, you won't. I'm not going to. No, I'm not. Wait, what's this guy's name? Stash and Scarfin. Oh my god. Stash and Scarfin. You know, I've been listening to a lot of Romstein lately. <laughs> Ooh. All the hamsters are contained in the room. Eleven hamsters separated into three enclosures? Oh, because overlapping. Oh, this will be a time. Uh, let's just kind of mess around. Let's do some preliminary research. As we call it in the field. Why does that square literally fit nowhere? Hold up, we need to find out where the square fits and we'll figure out where everything else goes. That's not helpful. You know what, screw it. We're gonna pretend that's where the square, the square can go. Uh, yeah, no, this is not, this is not good. <laughs> Um, no, that was not good enough. Oh, wait, I'm probably supposed to, like, make sure they aren't left out either. Oof. Wait, actually. No, wait. Yes, yes. Look, that wasn't bad. Oh, wait, that keeps it outside. Uh. Oh, sh Ah! Yeah. 
See, here's the thing. This is, like, all of them separate from each other, but two of them, like, just aren't in the picture. And that's, like, supposedly a concern. Okay, there's that. Actually, I wonder. No, those two are together. I wonder what the limits of this triangle are. Let's find out. I would love it if I could slightly rotate it. Eh. Darn it. I feel like if it requires that much precise placing, that's probably not where it's supposed to go, but I'm also not sure that I care. Let's see, maybe this is better. It's not better. Ah. Uh. Triangle, circle, square. I mean, that's kind of what I did. Oh no, I did triangle, square, circle. That's actually kind of close. Oh, wow. Okay. Oof. Those two are together. Bruh. That little... twerp. Oof. Yeah, is it not going well? Is it triangle, circle, square? Wait, oh my god. I did it! I see how to solve this now. Any mystery or any puzzle solved. Let's go. Mm. 
Oh, right, I gotta go to Tower Bridge. There we go. Oh, that's a fast car. There it is. Puzzle time. Okay. Just an attempt. Actually, no, this is better. There we go. There we go. Ooh, this won't finish it, though. Maybe... See, I think I, the main thing is to figure out what it is supposed to go with that T. And what we're supposed to do about it. Because I think what we can do is move that a little, get this over here. Okay, yeah, this is what I was thinking. We have that. We have that. And then we have this, but also it doesn't complete the staircase. But, wait, hold on. How much does that do? That's enough. Mm. That's not gonna work, though. Oof. Wait, that's kind of... Mm. Maybe... No, because it's a gap. And also because it's start. Okay. So that means that obviously doesn't go there. There we go. Okay, this might work out better. Oof, wait, that's not good. Ooh, okay. Wait, no, that's not gonna work either, is it? Oh, wait, yes it will. No, it won't. <laughs> they'll make it like halfway and then there'll just be nothing. I won 
Lavender. No. Just no. Hmm. They really just said with no gaps. One level at a time. Ugh. Wait. Oh, that's unfortunate. Fine. Really? Okay, if you say so. Oh, wait up. Oh, no. That's not going to work the way I thought it would. Because it works all the way up to, like, there. Unless there's that. But that's a gap. Mm. It seems counterintuitive, but maybe it'll help. No. Okay. Oh, wait, hold up. I think we did it. This is an interesting one. Yes. Let's go. We had it. Oh. Catriel is still unsure. <laughs> He's just admiring the name. Uh. 
Okay, well that explains that. Meow. I mean, I think they slipped up when the secretary or guard or whatever, who, whatever job she is, was to just like dog. Yep. Oh, a hunch. We got all the pieces, we know what's up. Alright, let's find out what happens. Solve it. Actually, my gut's rumbling too. I should get food. If only you were looking for a dog, I could probably have tracked him down. Oh god, voice acting. I forgot that they do that at this part of the game. Okay, I'll shut up now. A dog. Ah, that's an interesting point, Cheryl. Madame Dublay never actually said that Rex was a cat, did she? Bro, what? I assumed it was a cat because y'all told me it was a cat. We just assumed that because of all the cat decorations and toys at her residence. And I assumed that because y'all assumed that. You're right. How could we have been so stupid? And with a name like that, of course Rex isn't a cat. Rex is a dog. If she knew there was iguana food this whole time. But the nibbled plants oh. have teeth marks on the fruit. Yes, it's all unmistakably iguana -y. That's the unmistakable part. But she loves cats, doesn't she? She can like iguanas too, Cheryl. She had all those cat decorations and things as a way of controlling Rex. To stop him finding his way into parts of the house she didn't want him in. Is he scared of cats? In other words, she was using the fact that Iguanas dislike cats to contain him without having to resort to a cage. And she couldn't have told them this at the onset. Oh, I'm starting to think I might like Iguanas. Although, now I'm even more stumped. An Iguana could be hiding anywhere. On the contrary. If Rex is an Iguana, there's only one place he can be. Iguana. There. We know he loves bananas. There were banana skins, so Rex is on that boat. I'm 60% certain of it. We were just looking at the boat and you told me to go somewhere else. 60%? Not really. Huh. Hi, Rex. Darling, my precious Rexy Wexy, where have you been? You know, Madame Dublé, you could have specified all this from the beginning. I don't understand. I thought the white cat in the picture was Rex. Okay, yeah, there was that too. How did it? Well, why did you run away, you bad, bad boy? Bananas. <laughs> I think he had good reason, don't you? 
Oh. I beg your pardon, young lady. Don't you think he ran away because of all the feline trimmings around here? He can't stand cats. It's hardly surprising that he wanted to escape. Oh, but that's because I can't stand the idea of locking my precious Wepsy Wepsy in a cage. He's family, you know. You don't cage family. That would be cruel. He's an iguana. He goes in a tank. You know, that's a good point. Well, when you put it like that, I suppose. If you really love your pet as much as you say you do, you should swap all these cat knickknacks for iguana goods. What a suggestion! Oh, what? According to this letter from Madame Dublay, she's seen a great improvement in Rex's behavior since installing all the iguana decor. I forgot that was Ernest's voice. I don't like it. He stopped soiling the furniture. He did what? She no longer needs to confine him to particular parts of the house. What an amazing turnaround. When an owner treats her pet right, great things happen. Isn't that right? Okay, Cheryl. <laughs> no, Cheryl, it's not. Iguanas are just very territorial animals. With all the cat pictures and ornaments changed to iguana ones, Rex feels the house is his patch now, that his territory is established. So that's the reason. Oh, Miss Layton. I mean, as always. that also leads into Cheryl's point, but okay. Rats. Ooh. Wait, do do service dogs in England have to wear like yellow jackets? Yes. I'm not doing all that again. Ooh. Oh my god, that's a lot of cases. All right, well, that's kind of all I kind of have time for today, but um, thanks for everyone who stopped by, came in chat, all that good stuff. Um, weekdays, I'm probably going to do only like an hour, hour and a half. The weekends are where I'm probably going to go for the full two hours. Um, I'm still trying to figure all that out. Um, it's because my summer's looking a little more busy than I thought, but I enjoy this, so I'm going to keep doing it. But anyway, I... We'll see y'all. Mm. Do I have time this Saturday? I'll see y'all this Saturday, and if not over the weekend, then next Tuesday. Ciao.